Let's now think about the problem of sorting n elements in a two-level memory hierarchy. Initially, let's assume the processor is sequential. Here's a natural scheme based on the merge sort idea. Start by logically dividing the input into chunks of size proportional to, but no greater than z, so that a single chunk fits in fast memory. Next, read a chunk of the input from slow memory into fast memory. Then sort this chunk. I'll refer to this sorted output sitting in fast memory as a sorted run, or just run for short. As a mnemonic, this left to right arrow is to remind you that this chunk is sorted. Since the run is now sorted, write it back to slow memory. You'll repeat this process on each input chunk. Assuming each of the input chunks was of size f times z, where f is some constant less than 1, then you'll end up with about n over f times z sorted runs in total. I'll refer to everything we just did as phase 1 of the procedure. Again, that's partition the input into approximately z-sized chunks, and then for each chunk, you read a chunk, sort it, and write it back. Following the merge sort idea, in phase 2, you want to merge all the sorted runs into a single final sorted run. Before discussing that, let's analyze phase 1, the partition sorting step. 